September 13th, 2021, our weekly cover crop check. We're in week uh, 22 with the corn being planted. Uh, here's an ear. I'm going to break that open a little bit. We're in week 14 with our cover crop. Uh, take a look at our cover crop. So we do have some, we've been standing in the same spot for the past three weeks, uh, maybe four weeks. So this is some uh, vetch that actually was maybe hiding underneath um, the canopy. Uh, we had thought maybe before that it had senesced and had died, but obviously we can see that there's some, um, there's some vetch. Um, here's some flax that we got. There's two, two grasses here. There's a, a big tall grass and then there's a, there's a, some flax. So here's our flax that we got, or other broadleaves we got. It's either, we got either kale or rape that we have for broadleaves. Um, we've got uh, clover as another broadleaf, and then we've got some buckwheat. This buckwheat's knocked down. Uh, we come here, and yeah, this is where we're shooting our, our weekly video. And we've got um, annual ryegrass. So all this grass that we see, everything green that you see on the ground is uh, um, annual ryegrass. I just grabbed a random ear, and yes, it is a big ear. It's a uh, uh, 18 by 41 uh, for size, just a random ear. And we'll see where we're at. Um, we are more than half on milk line, probably uh, probably three quarters, I guess I would say. Um, I'm going to step to the side. We're going to shoot a video looking down these corn rows, and we're going to see more um, uh, kale and rape and more buckwheat. Um, and next week we'll probably go to a different spot because we're probably trampling this spot. So it might look a little different next week.